hi and welcome my name is Sonny and i welcome you back to let's play octopath Trevor. and just look at this this game looks beautiful um in the last part we just walked around some towns that we visited earlier ripple tide and atlas dam and got some quests and why is there a yellow thingy over here does that mean there's a quest over there hmm no, that's where we are, right? Is that where we are? Yellow thing? I think yes. I don't know. Yeah, it looks like it. Anyway, um, yeah. Not much was happening in the last part. We just talked with a lot of people. Got some quests done. And there was no battle, anything. No action. Maybe this part will make up for it. Because we have to go to the next town, city, whatever. And there are bound to be some battles on the way so yeah let's see what happens or maybe we are just in front of our new town i don't know no, i trust i got some money can i just go back and forth like that nope I mean we got 14 so i guess we have to wait a little you know why i think we don't get many battles i think it's because i think yeah we lose the rate of random encounters um how do i plus oh. yeah let's get some battles i mean need to level up my characters a little especially ophelia who we just recently got with only three levels behind cyrus so yeah not that bad you surprised your foe oh that's good oh man i don't even know how battle how battles work in this game um, cleric skills. How can I summon? You fight with us, whoever you are. Yeah, Cyrus. Boom. Awesome. Are you vulnerable? Nope. I have to find out, right? Stats, are you vulnerable? Nope. Good job. Are you a bull? Awesome. I think the enemies level up with me, so yeah should always get like a good amount of experience right uh, where do i go oh perfect shadow soul stone what is shadow the hedgehog doing here and why do we have a soul oh, completely new enemies hey vulnerable against wind no that one enemy just took one damage what oh he was fleeing what oh damn you okay let me guess fire no why not oh what did you just do Hmm. Lightning. Oh, yeah, awesome. Steps. No, but he's dead. Oh, it's so good that we have a healer now. Things get a little out of hand. You can always heal up again. Eight hundred. 
And there's a cave. Hmm, danger level 25. Dang. Ah. <laughs> Let's just do that. Bing. Ah. Can't do anything. I have like a lot of good equipment now. One guy has like three shields. What? Uh. Holy light. Are you vulnerable against light? Nope. I have to find out their weakness. Okay. I mean, I can just go in battle with a uh, with Cyrus, but. Why not like try out? Who are? Break. No, he isn't broken. No. No, you are. Oh no, he's not. Ah. Uh. Good thing is I can go all out with my attacks because. They gotta level up they heal up each everything so yeah i can just go crazy on each battle swaki that's why i have to go okay well i bet it's gonna be a battle nope okay Hmm. Is this not a town? Yeah, we switch from like desert to snow to forest, in, like each area. They're not really big areas, are they? Who are you guys? You're all vulnerable against daggers, it seems. <laughs> I don't have daggers, so be vulnerable against wind. No, <laughs> dang. Nope. Fire. It must be fire. Dang. <laughs> Can't be vulnerable against ice. Ice is right around the corner. <laughs> Holy light. They are actually one of against light. <laughs> well, they are using bows, so nope. Not much, I figured. They're using both. They can't be one of against other bows, right? What if they accidentally shot themselves? Lances. Nope. Uh, lightning. Yes. And steps. No. I think I don't. They don't. No. Okay. Whatever. One more encounter with those guys, and we'll find out with Cyrus. Uh, over there. I think. Wow. Well, we. I can barely see anything. Herb of Awakening. Where am I right now? Fire and staffs. And wind. Dang it. They're not vulnerable against the wind. Never. And I would almost say that this game is really easy now, but as soon as I face off against... Oh, he's out of SP. As soon as I face off against like the next boss, I'm gonna get my butt kicked again. So yeah, I'm gonna be quiet. 
I can't really do anything else. Uh. Uh. Both. Yes, I knew it. Because they were they are forest animals. I know I can use like BP, but that's kind of a waste for like normal enemies. And yeah, Cyrus got all of his stats back, and we got 300. Do we? Can we learn? Oh, I can actually learn something with her. Luminescent steal light based damage to all foes. I think I'm gonna do that. New support skill persistence. No, we need 500. All status enhancements you receive will last for one additional turn. Yes, receive so only if I use like use it like on her, then yes. Oh, we have to go down there. Looks like Swaki. I mean, we could just go around here and don't visit this town and continue our journey with all those free characters, but why would I do that? Okay, now. You can attack everyone. Awesome. This makes her even more useful now. Fire. Body bash. Oh, that didn't do anything. Oh, we tried. Ah. Boom. Why is a pick weak against staffs? I don't get it. Boom. And done. How much money do we have? A lot. And oh, nom nom nom. Healing grave. Looks like a woodcutter shack over there. Hi. Oh, fifty. Uh, headgear, yeah, why not? Uh, who can wear that? Who can wear that? Yes, everyone. Oh, yeah, I've bought this one. I forgot. Hmm, yes. A little less elemental attack, more physical, uh, whatever. Who treasure? My reputation doesn't go down if I open up treasure chest that's lying in the bright door challenge. <laughs> and let's try again. Uh, springly earring. Why not? Mm, maybe find. Let's find this one person who reduces what uh, what I have to buy, uh, what I have to 
pay for the in let's try ha discount at the end that's exactly what i wanted to <laughs> awesome empty coin pouch if i buy this do i get more if i sell it let's see where is it nope he ripped me off how dare he this looks like the playable character that we are gonna find in this part let's try hidden item yeah i'm playing we really risky for some reason no i want that a leaf of life a cane bow 3852 3852 what this one is actually better yeah the thing is if i start the quest for this character then i kind of like have to watch the whole backstory again which is like takes usually like one part and then we have to do like the quest for this character which also takes a part so i'm trying to not start the quest right now and wait a little battle eggs i don't i'm not even talking with those guys i'm just like going and ask them to sell stuff to me or something or give me information <laughs> Dang, they are from training in 10 moments and they'll be master zandar's number one apprentice just don't wait in i train every day that i might one day have even have half a skill with the boas master zanta class all right, hero tail. Okay, let's take a look at everything else before we talk with this here important character. Oh God! Okay. All seem quite knowledgeable about trade. Yep, sure looks like it. I'm Tressa, the trader. Well, I guess this is a really small area compared to all the other towns or settlements that we found so far. So yeah, I guess we're gonna talk with this character now because there's nothing else literally left to do. Let me save. Just because. I, I understand it not for what reason would such a beast come to our woods of this herald some greater ill that comes away are you a boy or a girl okay her name is Hennet and she's a hunter one of the less descendants of a proud and ancient clan she makes her home here in Swaki deep in the dark wood this seasoned a seasoned huntress roams the forest with Linda her first friend now her mind often turns to a master who left village one year ago on a dangerous hunt from which he has yet to return. When a local noble came seeking aid, she answered the call and was tasked with hunting a vicious beast that plays that plagues the nearby foes forest. <laughs> and so she makes for the Whisperwood with her loyal companion Lind at her side. She will need fierce allies on the patch she has chosen take honey along yes of course in the beginning of the tale you know if i wanted to role play this then i would probably not hear her tale if we play with like tressa or something we just met her and we don't know anything about her but still decide to like 
uh, help her or something. One year ago. ああ、簡単な狩りだ、ないだろうな。そう。心配いらん。俺はお前の師匠だぞ。お前の師匠は狩りの達人だ。すぐに終わらせて帰ってくるさ。その不服そうな顔は私が心配しているのはそこではない。寄り道はほどほどにな。ああ。少しぐらいダメか。ダメに決まっている。忘れたとは言わせないぞ。狩りの依頼の手付金をかけごとに使って逆に借金をこさえて帰ってきたのああ、あれな。ベクターホローの武闘大会で賭けをした時のことか。魔物の強さはわかるんだが、人の強さを見切るのは苦手でな。<笑> <あー>、<笑><笑> それなら、なぜ賭けなんかしたんだ。エリザに建て替えてもらって、この間返済が終わったばかりだぞ。本当に狩り以外はいい加減だな。いっそがけど。一の矢の失敗は二の矢の成功ってな。俺みたいになるな
あれからよこした手紙が一通だけとは師匠は本当にいい加減だなよーハミット俺だお前のお師匠様だ拾った時効の挨拶は省くぞいつ届くかもわからんからな性格手段からの依頼を受けて3ヶ月俺は標的の獲物を追っている。Oh, so、dead. 赤目と呼ばれる魔物だ。赤目って名前も性格士たちがつけたもので、正体は全くわからん。こいつはなかなか厄介だ。罠には引っかからんし、時々。俺の動きを読んでいる気もする。知能が高いのか、勘がいいのか、なかなか尻尾をつかませてくれん。こちらに気づいたのか、そろそろ縄張りを返そうだ。赤目の移動先はストーンガードと俺は睨んでいる。Oh, we have to fight it, right? Because it said, like, there's a monster attacking this village or something. And we got introduced to her. Daga, ma, Shimpa is Luna. Canarazu Akameo Kate, Morini Kairu. Sorema de Murano Koto, Tanondazo, Aito. 心配性の弟子へ、ザンターより。珍しい。師匠が素直に、時間がかかると言うとは。赤目とは、それほど手ごわい獲物なのか。それともこれは、ただの寄り道の口実いや。確かにいい加減で調子が良くて軽い人だがやると言ったことは必ずやり遂げるそういう人だあ,あそうだなこれつりんだあれだこれつりんだこれつりんだこれつりんだこれつりんだこれつりんだこだ<laughs> oh God. She got on a line at a Nika, son to the Coroni, Timirka. I did not put those two together. All right, let's go and speak to the headman. Who is you, I guess? Yeah, headman, how might my bow serve ye today? Yeah. Every day, those comes here seeking work. Sometimes I wonder if thou art truly thy master's apprentice. But just in sight now, there is no hunt today. So, is there aught else I might do? Hmm. Well, the youngsters are always in need of lessons. Thou couldst give them a lesson or two in bowmanship. Clan of the Dark would inherit inherited the law of the beasts and the trees. Yet today only Doe and Santa can truly use it that law. Why, right, when I was a mere stripling. <laughs> yes, yes, I heard your stories before and know、uh, how long they are. <laughs> ho ho, long wine tales are the voice of many an old man. I apologize, child. But if Doe could show up the youngsters the way of the hunt, I would be grateful. <laughs> I saw two of them waiting eagerly in the square. Perhaps Doe could start with them.、Yeah. It will be done. h e n r i can use beasts to provoke people into battle. What? Provoke this individual? Go for it, my friend. Training time, is it? I am ever ready. I have to beat up children.
Oh, I can only use okay. Jeez. Don't you think that's a little overkill for some? Why do I only have five of those? What? I think Okay. I'm beating up children with my Jaguar Panther line thingy. Ung. Dog grows adept at fighting. Yeah. But thou must be more cautious than ever, for don't know now is just enough to get thyself into trouble. I will thank thee, Hanit. Oh, my back. Oh. I am about to die. <laughs> uh, what? Go for my friend. Pray teach me, Huntress Hanit. Jeez. Oh. Okay, can we like capture animals or something? <laughs> I'm gonna find out in the next part. Something. Oh, I slashed through my face. Ah. Okay, cool. Well, does those feel most attuned to thy surroundings? Ah. Yes, I feel much more able to anticipate where Swift Crane might dart next. Very good, an important lesson that I just beat up some children. Huntress Hanit! What is it? The headman sent me to find thee. Said he must speak us with thee right away. Then I will make haste. He is at home, I take it. Yes, follow me. An urgent hunt, mayhap. Headman, you wish to see me? Yes, a request had come in from the demands of Lord Siren. Would seem a beast bad straight into his provincial forest. And he will let gone. Just so, he asked it for a best hunter. And my master Santa is of the hand, that means D. Understood. Always remember, Hanit, since time immemorial, ours has been village of great hunters and huntresses. Yes, far and wide, beyond the edges of the dark wood, our home. Hmm. The bard sang it of our exploits in all the realms lauded fair Swaki as the home of the true hunter. Is that now how it went? So ho ho, I have I told it that many times. Long winded tales, my dear. <laughs> Otherwise, an old man, yes. As far as for the hunt, I am ready when needed. Um. Excellent. Lord Siren's messenger awaited inside. We will tell it thee all thou needs to know. I will speak it to him at once. Hanit, pray it, do not, Master Santa would thee not. What? <laughs> of course, thank ye. Oh, this is gonna be really bad reading all this. My apologies for the urgency of the matter, but Molten Star pay little heed to convenience of man. Yeah. I am here to serve. Tell me more about this beast. Yeah. Your cry is to be a fearsome beast that has wandered into the Whisperwood from the gods nowhere. Mm -hmm. A monster that is straight from its home? Let me guess, Red Eye. Yeah. I just this morning a merchant and an injury company companion fetched up at a manor in frightful shape. As one man told it, the others was in no condition to speak. Their caravan had been waylaid by the beasts, and they were the only survivors. 
I just don't know this creature was responsible. That siren scholar were called upon to investigate the matter. From the merchant's testimony, they conclude the men were attacked by a savage beast known as Gizama. 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 I have heard of this creature. It's bell. A baleful roar would make it an unlikely fit for the tranquil whisperwood. His lordship is most anxious to protect his subjects, needless to say. He seeks the help of the most capable hunter in this village, and so in Master Santa's absence, we turn to you. What say you, Hennet? Will you free our air province of this unholy menace? Tell thy lord that it shan't fail him. <laughs> Indeed. There's a dignity about you that Master Zanta lacks, but I see you share his passion for your uh, calling. I hope you will continue to inherit only his better qualities. <laughs> Master is a fine teacher. He showed it by example both what a hunter ordered and ordered not to don. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> well said. Would seem we are in safe hands indeed. Oh. Yes, though are. And here we are. So I must do my duty and hunt the beast. Thine offer is a generous one, yet the path ahead is fraught with danger. How curious, Lynn Judge D. Worthy. It is not often she warm with the strangers. I shall accept thine offer. Lend me thy strength in battle. The monster had been sighted in a whisper woods. It is there that we must go. Hennet joined the team, the party, whatever. What? No. Okay, boom. Awesome. Now we have a four. A group of four. Five. <laughs> because, yeah. Who's this guy? He he actually looks like he would be a good main character. What the? Uh, I guess I cannot go outside. So far, so yeah. Are we all healed up? Awesome. Okay, we're gonna take a look at Hannet in the next part and go to defeat this one monster we have to defeat in the next part as well. So yeah. Thanks for watching. Please consider leaving a like, a comment, or subscribe. That would be really nice of you. And I'll see you in the next part. Bye bye.